Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm out of this. The newest expansion for the Pokemon TCG is called Unveil Paradox Rift. I just released, and in today's video, I'm going to be opening one of each of the Pokemon Center exclusive Roaring Moon and Iron Valiant Elite Trainer boxes. So without further further ado, let's get it. All right, guys. So here we have it: Pokemon Center exclusive Elite Trainer boxes for Roaring Moon and Iron Valiant. Let's start with Roaring Moon. Here's the front of the Elite Trainer box. There's the top Scarlet and Violet Paradox Rift. There's the bottom of it. And the sides. Here's the back. So they did Roaring Moon as the, I guess, front cover or the cover of the actual Elite Trainer box. But the promo that you get inside is not actually Roaring Moon. As you can see here, it's Screamtail. But here are the contents. And here is the Iron Valiant. Ugh. Both of these Pokemon I like. I think I'm gonna be more. Actually, no, I'm gonna say Iron Valiant is more my favorite in terms of the Pokemon wise, anyway. Roaring Moon is. Oh, I don't know. But I think I prefer Iron Valiant. So there's the front, there's the top, there's the bottom side, other side, and here's the back. So this one. For Iron Valiant, you get Iron Bundle instead. That's the promo card that you get inside there, and there's the content, so I'll leave that on there for a second. Alright, so first, I think I'm gonna crack open the Roaring Moon. Let me crack this open and I'll be right back. The hero of the artworks from the inside sleeve of the Elite Trainer Box. There's Roaring Moon. There's Iron Valiant. There's Terraform Garchomp. And armor rouge here's the player's guide but just so that i don't spoil myself yet this is probably what i'm gonna check out at the end of the video so if you want to see the set list check at the end of the video when i do a recap all right so here's your code card for the rory moon elite trainer box i'm guessing you get the promo cards which is the scream tail condition markers damage counters and dice or die should i say so this one is red and blue and then the the damage counters are like a teal slash grey color. Here are your sleeves, or moon sleeves. Again, I don't like the border. I wish they did the full extended art instead of the border. Um, here is a closer look. And as always, frosted. Yeah, it's frosted. Here's your deck dividers. Full, full on face of the rolling moon. And back more of a zoomed out look with the whole body that's your deck dividers and here are your two screamtail promo cards the one that the, the one on the left is the one you get in a regular etb and the one on the right is the pokemon center stamped one oh these are really this is a really nice promo card all the coloring it's just nice the vibrantness yeah this is a nice card um screamtail is basically i think jigglypuff in an ancient version <laughs> And you get what should be 11 packs, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, perfect. And then here are the artworks for each, if I can find them, Garchomp, there we go. And here are your 4 artworks for each pack. So Roaring Moon, Iron Valiant, Garchomp, Terraform EX and Armor Rouge. Alright, so before we start ripping into the packs, guys, if you enjoy my videos and you haven't already, I'd appreciate if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more. When I reach 500 subscribers, I'll be doing a giveaway for the most recent Elite Trainer Box for me hitting 500 subscribers. Wait, what further is to do? Let's get it. Alright, guys, Paradox Rift. Par Paradox Rift. Our first opening. Pokemon Center exclusive ETPs. Oh, usually these have good pulls for me. Let's see if this is going to hold true in Paradox Rift. This video is going to be probably a little bit longer as well, so I'm going to go a bit slower to kind of check out the commons, uncommons, all the cards pretty much. Probably one, nice. So, grab some snacks, grab a drink, sit back and relax, guys. Pull this apart, reverse. Post score, are we going to get first pack magic? Nope, Zartu Hollow. Alright, so first pack was a dud. Oh, I've kind of been looking forward to this set because of the ancient and the future. The new 
uh, uh, what they call it? Uh, mechanic? Yeah, mechanic. Ancient and future mechanic. Dot law. Oh, because I'm going to be looking at these cards. Seeing some nice artworks, if any. It's not going to cut into my talking and stuff, but anyway. Oh! Second pack magic, we've got on. Alyssa Pod EX. Alright, so early hit from a EX, an EX early hit from a Pokemon Center exclusive ETB. Nice, not bad. At least getting one hit, I guess, even if it's an EX from ETB. Whether it's Pokemon Center or regular, it's decent. Best outcome is to get at least two or three pulls, I guess. But 11 packs and a Pokemon Center one. Two, three pulls, maybe four, if you're lucky. And then, um, hopefully, full art or, um, it's IRs, or even IRs. Ooh, nice. nice! Speaking of IRs, our first IR as well. Nice. Swablu. IR right here. Nice, nice, nice. That's quite a nice artwork as well. It's blending in with the seagulls. That's cool. Yeah, um, speaking of the ancient and future Pokemon, which team are you guys? Ancient or future? Me personally, I prefer the ancient Pokemon. As much as I like the Futures as well, I think one of my favorite out of the Ancient and Future Pokemon is um, the f in the Future one, which is the... What is it called again? Iron Thorns, which is basically um, Tyranitar Future Form. That's probably my favorite Future Form or out of the Ancient and Futures Pokemon. But all in all, I think Ancient Pokemon are better. Reverse Deoxys and Juggles. Here's the first look at our Future card. I think Iron Juggalus, which is the future version of Hydreigon. I love the, the kind of double thingy. What do you want to call it? The little, what are they called? What are they called? Gradient. Gradient. So from Grey, it goes to the future. That is cool. Nice. The fu the ancient and future Pokemon that they put in this one, in Paradox Rift, I would say are cool. But um, I think the cooler ones are coming, like the Iron Thorns. The, wait, is Iron Hands in this as a future Pokemon or oh, SIR or anything? Oh, another ancient or well, another mechanic ancient Pokemon, Sliver Wing. Nice. So, this one is Volcarona but in ancient form. So, that's a regular uncommon. Go guys, Rika, Mantai, and Aegislash. As excited as I am for this set as well, guys, I keep going off topic, um, I think, but you know. As excited as I am for this set guys, I don't I don't think I'm gonna go too heavy yet. At least not just yet. Because I wanna complete I wanna go back and complete a couple of my other sets like the Scarlet and Violet. Um but they are both Obsidian Flames, Scarlet and Violet 151, Zubat, Zashin. Yeah, so for this set I'm gonna hold back a little bit. I'm gonna hold back a little bit and not go too heavy. Obviously I'm gonna open up every product that they released. as a video and then after that I'm not gonna buy any more booster boxes or anything just yet I'm gonna go back and complete I think I'm gonna complete my obsidian flames first because that's the closest probably 151 and then scarlet and violet then we we'll... nothing too special yet to be honest not... oh here we go a full art nice Cofog... Cofogrigus 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 yes Cofogrigus full art nice perfect kind of in time for Halloween although it's gone by now when this set releases, but nice. Coferigus EX full up. We have four packs left, and so far we've kind of pulled one of each rarity an EX, an IR, and a full up. We need to see an SIR, which I have a feeling we're not going to pull, and a gold card. That's about it, really. Yeah, for the higher rarities, we need a SIR and a gold card now. Techno Reader, another future um, item card or trainer item card. Steenie, Cloud Red, Wisma, Espresso. Yeah, so in terms of Master Set, I'm so close with Obsidian Flames. Um, I have all the reverses, all the commons and uncommons, and hollows. I think I need one or two more. Um, EXs and then one full art iron bundle future nice 
keep getting interrupted with these nice cards. So that's the Iron Bundle Future, Radiant card, Techno Radar, Carrot Seed, Vanillite, plus what? Yeah, so I need, I think, one IR, two Full Arts, and then the Gold card. I've got all their size, yep. So I think six cards in total um, for Obsidian Flames I need. In terms of um, all my days, I think I just saw peak all my days. In terms of completing the master anyway or the higher end, I think I'll see peak. I think there might be something big in this one. I don't know if it's just a regular EX or if it's a gold. The mask minimum. Oh, Yahoo! wow. I did see peak, but it was just the EX. Nice, I'm a rude EX. Nice, so two EXs. Nice. With one pack remaining. Alright guys, last pack. Not too bad, you know. Like I said, four four hits in a elite trainer box from eleven packs. Pokemon Center, mind you. Usually those are better than regular ones, I reckon. But yeah, um, talking about Amaruja as well. When are they gonna give Cerulege some some love? I need to see some Cerulege love. Ancient Booster Energy Capsule, Ancient Valkyrie, Finger Tink, and a Veltal. Alright guys, so moving on to Iron Valiant. Let me crack this open. Here's the player's guide for the Iron Valiant. Again, I'm going to open this at the end of the video. Or we'll check it out at the, end of the at the end of the video with a recap. Here's your code card for the Iron Valiant. You probably get the Iron Bundle um, promos. Here's your Iron Valiant deck dividers. Here's the Iron Valiant sleeves. This one, I think they did a little bit better with the border because it matches the actual colour of the background as well whereas the roaring moon one was red and the background was yellow but this one's a little bit better and here are your iron bundle promo cards so the left one is the regular one and then the right one is the promo center stamped <sighs> between the two promos oh i don't know if i'll give it to iron bundle or if i'll give it to scream tail oh close i think i'm gonna give it to iron bundle i think iron bundle is the better looking promo let me know in the comments down below guys which is which you prefer the iron bundle or the scream tail i'm getting in progress there you go a little bit and what should be 11 packs again let's double check one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven yep eleven and before we start ripping into these packs guys we're probably about halfway through the video maybe we're at least one trainer box down if you're currently enjoying the video and you start with me this far, I'd appreciate it if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more. Wanna reach 500 subscribers? I'll be doing a giveaway for the most recent Elite Trainer Box of me hitting 500 subscribers. Without further ado, ado, let's get it. Alright, guys, so 11 packs from Iron Valiant. Oh, these open a bit more easier. Um, Four hits from Roaring Moon. An IR, an, an IR, two X's, and a full art. Nice. Um, and Iron Valiant do better in some ways because I prefer the Iron Valiant. I'm hoping it does. Evil Aspapra. Nice. So this one kind of one-ups the EX is the Terraform EX, the Serena EX. Nice, nice. Alright, so first pack magic on the Iron Valiant already. Nice, nice. I'll take that. Um, and it's a Terraform EX as well. I mean there's the same rarity this one's skip yeah the same rarity as the ex is but the terraform because of the terraform it gives it that little bit extra texture which in some ways i kind of reckon one ups on the regular ex yeah moss next cloud nailer minial raw flip bug fun cool yeah um so far as of release of um paradox rift if you guys are opening or collecting paradox rift let me, know, let me know in the comments down below guys if you're enjoying the set um wash your chase cards have you pulled your chase cards etc etc i'd like to know glygor i'm looking too far my camera's there um sir sir time oh my days sir in this one nice so this i i kind of uh busted my myth about the Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Boxes being batched in one video but so far, apart from that video most of them have been batched so maybe this might replace 
the full art in this one. We'll see. But we pulled an EX and SIR. Are we going to get an IR as well? Recon, nice. Right, Recon as our first special illustration rare. I'll take it. That was second pack in as well, right? Or was that third? That was second pack in, I think. So second pack in. But I, I am valiant, excuse me. Has already trumped, I would say, the Roaring Moon. With that special illustration rare and the Terraform EX. Wow. Yes, I was hoping Valiant would win, and looks like it's going to. Don Donzo, Luzo, Machine, Reverse Cobat, Simmer Sage, help you. Alright, so there we go, there's a cooldown. Um, I'm gonna guess the last remaining packs ain't gonna have anything. Um, what was I talking about before pulling that Reaper as well? Was I talking about anything? I don't remember. I do not remember. Um, I guess we can talk about the batching as well in terms of cases. Actually, no, I didn't buy a case of these this time. I only bought three of each. But usually, Pokemon Center ones are kind of batch. You get the same kind of rarities and poor rates. Ooh, nice. So, here we go. Magby IR. Oh, that's a nice artwork for Magby. That is nice. On camera, it doesn't show it that nice, but in person, these look a lot nicer than they do. Magby IR, nice. Right, so one EX, one IR, one SIR. I'm gonna go and call it and say we're gonna get one more EX. One more EX. And then that would, in some ways, prove, not prove, but kind of solidify a little bit my theory of Pokemon Center ETBs being batched. Vanilla, Spoochin. Do you know what though? From Pokemon Center ETBs, pulling one SIR out of one of the Pokemon Center ETBs I get for each set is a good start. Pulling an SIR from any ETB is a good start. Pokemon Center, regular retail ones, really good start, I love it. Especially as a master setter anyway. Tandem Mouse, Boxer Escape, Brute Bonnet. Here's another ancient type Pokemon, Brute Bonnet. This one is Among Us, Among Us in ancient form, I guess. I love the gradient, the gradient is nice. So you got the regular darkness. Um, background and then it just radiates into the ancient kind of fossil sort of thing with four packs left three hits nice um and sir a terraform if i can get my hand into that um terraform ex and ir i'm happy with that i'm happy with that um i would have preferred a pokemon in terms of the sir but i'm happy with that it's an sir nonetheless so i'll definitely take that technical machine turbo energized Jirachi reverse Sandy Shops EX Ancient. Nice. Plus the no, that's not an ancient. So our first um ancient EX Pokemon, which is Sandy Shocks. With Magneton being like metal and kind of thingy, which is what the future Pokemon are. They're metal kind of ancient stuff. Kinda doesn't fit right with the ancient form in terms of Magneton and Sandy Shocks. But Sandy Shocks EX nonetheless. There you go. Alright, so that's three packs left and four pulls. Nice. I will take those pull rates for sure. Even the rarities of the pull rates. Um, the last three pack might not have anything. If my. You might get lucky and pull one extra than what my theory is about bashing, which. Unless I'm getting... Nope, I thought I saw Shine, or better Shine, in the last pack, which I thought. And then at the same time I thought I was going to get dudded, or um, baited. But, okay, so Flip Bug, Great Coco, Honage, Dwebble, Rock Trio, Hitman Raider, Steamy, Velto, OC. Let's go! Oh! Norman, full up. So this one might have given us one extra, but with a full up. So that special illustration rare was a, I guess a bonus. But nice, Norman, full up. Last pack, guys. Are we gonna get last pack magic? Most likely not. But I can't complain. I cannot complain about this first experience for Paradox Rift. 
from my first experience with these Pokemon Center ETBs. Um, you're probably going to see this video on Sunday. On the following video will be probably, hopefully Monday, um, of me doing the verses of the Pokemon Center and the regular ETBs. Here we go. Nathalie, nope, no last part, but Chimpao. One of my favorite new, I think they're, they're legendaries, right? Are they legendaries or they're pseudo legendaries? The legendary ish anyway but one of my favorite new legendary pokemon all right guys so it's about time we check out the player's guide let's see i'm gonna skip straight to the back i guess might as well check out the irs here we go here we go hopefully you can see those nicely um so we've got a crossle dotla old school magby which i called i am off that's quite that's nice the i am off is nice snow run Mantai, Vanillish. Oh, all of these IRs look nice, vibrant, and just packed. Like the whole backgrounds and stuff is just nice. Loser, plus one minion. I guess two of the chases from the IRs, I can say, because plus one minion, they're so cute, that's nice. Plus one minion was Gen 1 or Gen, Gen 2 or Gen 3, I don't remember. Anyway, my generation at the time. Blitzel, Joltik. That's bad for that artwork is nice. Give me cool Groudon. Oh. One of my favorite Pokemon as well. Groudon right there. That looks amazing. That looks amazing. Mianchao. Minio. Garganical. Sliver Wing. Barbator. No. Oh my days. All of these IRs are so nice. Evelto. Oh, Mopeko. I think that's my number one IR chase right there. That has to be Mopeko. That looks so sick. Fruit Bonnet. Steelix. Oh, that's nice as well. Oh. When they have like a story or a sort of thing where the Pokemon are actually doing like sort of everyday daily needs that we do. Construction, stuff like that, it's so cool. Um Perfon, Age Slash, A Bomb, Loud Red, look how vibrant and loud red that card is. Swablu, Porygon Z, Psychozor, Iron Juggalus. That looks cool, it's like a future kind of um environment and then full arts we got the first last ex terraform armor rouge oh see i can't wait for cerulege's one i can't wait for cerulege i love these two pokemon the armor rouge and the cerulege but cerulege is more my favorite god trump terraform oh serena ex holy support top coco iron hands oh there is the iron hands full art okay so there's the iron hands full art nice this pokemon more or less carried me through the Scarlet and Violet games when it comes to the seven star raids this Pokemon was amazing Kofa Grigus Iron Valiant Pupa EX Terraform Toxtricity Sandy Shocks EX Nice Ultra Rare Roaring Moon oh, all of these cards are so nice in terms of the full arts as well Alteria Godengo Mousehold Bombardier Ari Melos and there's trainer cards and the full art trainers Norman, Parasol Lady, Professor. I just found my chase. I just found my chase. Professor Sardivide, the full art. Professor Turo's scenario, Rika, Rowak, Chantel, Tulip. God Trump special special illustration special illustration rare time. So God Trump EX, Police Support, Coco, Iron Hands. Oh, there is a SIO of Iron Hands. Although it makes him look tiny. This is more like a background art. I am Valiant, Sandy Shocks, Rolling Moon, Kodengo, that's nice. That golden was nice. It's, it's, I've seen it as well because it's plastered everywhere. In thumbnails and stuff like that. Oterio, Mila, Parasol Lady. Probably a, probably the chase. I think this is the Japanese chase anyway. My chase. I just saw it all my days. Definitely my waifu chase. Professor Stardust Vitality. Professor Turo Scenario. Rico, the one we just pulled. Tulip. And then a the gold cast of Garchomp. I am Valiant Rowing Moon, nice. Nice gold card as well this time around. Beach Court, Counter Catcher, Luxurious Cape, and Reversal Energy. And these are the promos. But that, this video is going to be a long ass video. Um, as I'm recording, it's 40 minutes. Editing down is probably going to be like a 30 minute video. But anyway guys, that was two Pokemon Center exclusive Elite Trainer Boxes featuring Roaring Moon and I am Valiant. Here are the hits. So there's a promos, four hits, EX, EX, IR, 
and a full up. My first one that was from Roaring Moon. From Iron Valiant, you got Iron Bundle, Magni IR, Serena EX, Rika SIR, another EX, and then a full up. So this one gave me a bonus SIR. But if you look at it, it this is a theory, kind of batched ETBs from Pokemon Center. You got two EXs, a full up, and an IR. Two EXs, two EXs. There we go. An IR, a full up. But my bonus was the SIR, which is even better. But yeah, guys, that was two Pokemon Center exclusive ETBs. If you enjoyed the video, if you, if you stuck with me to the end, I'd appreciate it if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn the notification on for more. When I reach 500 subscribers, I'll be doing a giveaway for the most recent Leech Renobox of me hitting 500 subscribers. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.